Six most terrifying viruses that exist on Earth today. The human species has been battling viruses since time immemorial. And while there are diseases that we managed to finally eradicate through the advancements of science and medicine, apparently we're still a long way from claiming complete victory against viruses. In this video, we feature six of the most terrifying viruses that still exist on Earth today. Number 6. Dengue Virus Dengue virus is the leading cause of infection that results to high fever, severe headache, hemorrhaging, and in the worst cases, death. Simply called dengue fever, the outbreak of this disease was first spotted around the 1950s in Southeast Asian countries like the Philippines and Thailand. It has since spread throughout the tropical and subtropical regions of the world. The World Health Organization estimated that close to 3 billion people are at risk of contracting the dengue virus. The disease itself affects 80 to 100 million people each year. Meanwhile, death toll reaches 25,000 a year, and this figure could still increase as the world becomes warmer than ever. Humans can get sick from a single bite of a dengue-infected mosquito, and it's quite scary to know that there are tons of them buzzing around as we speak. Even worse is the fact that there's still no vaccine developed against the virus. Good thing, though, the fever is highly treatable and not contagious. Number 5. Ebola virus. The Ebola virus outbreak is probably one of the most highly publicized disease outbreak cases in history. Since its first discovery in 1976 in the Democratic Republic of the Congo, the epidemic has already claimed the lives of thousands of people, including locals and members of foreign medical volunteer groups. What makes the disease terrifying is the fact that it's nearly impossible to know if you've already contracted the virus, since the disease still has an incubation period between 2 and 21 days. Even worse, some infected persons are asymptomatic, meaning they don't display the common symptoms of the disease, such as severe headache, muscle pain, high fever, vomiting, and hemorrhaging. One of the most frightening manifestations of the disease is severe bleeding, of which some could be seen bleeding through their eyes and mouth. With a 90% mortality rate, Ebola disease could certainly send someone six feet below the ground in a matter of days. It can spread through close contact with bodily secretions and fluids from affected individuals, although there's no evidence that can determine if the disease gets passed on via casual contact. As of today, there is still no vaccine or cure for Ebola virus disease. Number 4. Rabies The thing about rabies is that it's a zoonotic virus, meaning it can be transmitted through the bite of an animal, most commonly dogs. Upon contraction, the virus will make its way into the patient's brain through the nerves where it undergoes an incubation phase lasting from several months to a few years. Once the infection reaches the central nervous system, it will incite symptoms like acute body pains, uncontrollable and often violent movements, as well as its most recognizable sign, which is the inability to swallow water. Once these manifestations subside, the patient will experience periods of mania, which would then progress into coma and eventually death. Exposure to rabies is almost rare in most developed countries. However, the threat remains probable among developing nations like Africa and India. Vaccines are both readily available for pets and for humans, making the disease very preventable. Number 3. Influenza Clocking in more than a half million deaths a year, influenza is probably one of the most prolific killer viruses in human history and the tally just keeps on adding. The virus spreads around the globe in some form of yearly outbreaks. Larger outbreaks, known as pandemics, occur at least twice every century. And when this disease hits, it hits hard. The Spanish influenza in 1918, for instance, caused up to 100 million deaths. The Asian influenza in 1957 
around 2 million deaths. Hong Kong influenza in 1968, 1 million deaths. New strains of this virus are being discovered almost every year, making it nearly impossible for scientists to keep up. Runny nose, sore throat, fever, and body pains are just some of the common symptoms of the disease. While most affected individuals could easily survive infections, there are those, especially the unvaccinated ones, who can't make it to the end of the cycle and would end up dead. Number 2. Rotavirus You may not know it, but rotavirus has actually affected every child on the planet at least once in their lives. The good thing is that with the help of available vaccines, human immune systems can get stronger against the virus after each infection. Unfortunately, in places where proper health care is limited, this disease is a killer. It can spread rapidly through contaminated food and water. Once infected, children would often suffer high fever, coupled with severe diarrheal illnesses that dehydrates them to literal death. According to WHO, more than half a million children below the age of five died from rotavirus infection. And number one, HIV. International health organizations like WHO and the CDC brand the human immunodeficiency virus. HIV is the deadliest virus to ever exist in the modern world right now. Close to 40 million people have died from HIV since the disease was discovered in the 1980s. This virus attacks the immune system by infecting the cells. This significantly weakens the person's immunity, rendering them susceptible to more health infections. This is the reason why most HIV victims would go on to develop AIDS or acquired immunodeficiency syndrome the most dreaded sexually transmitted disease to ever have been known. HIV affects everyone, including children, and can be contracted through exchange of bodily fluids and secretion through sexual activities like vaginal, anal, and oral sex. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this.